Hey everyone, this is Steve from Gamers Nexus Down out here at CES 2015. We are at Kingston and the HyperX suite here at the at Caesars Palace in Las Vegas. Uh, first, all this content brought to you by CyberPower Cyber Vapor Gaming PC. Right now, we're looking at PCIe SSDs, and this is actually an M2 or M.2 uh, HyperX Predator SSD that has been mounted to a PCB matte black for PCIe usage. So this operates at 1400. Uh, slash a thousand read write megabytes per second that's sequential and a hundred thousand hundred thousand IOPS uh, read write uh, that's 4k IOPS pretty good performance it's expected to release late February price is yet unknown and the new Savage SSD is coming out that is a successor to the HyperX 3k SSD price also unknown on that coming out shortly after this drive uh, but it, it should be good for most gaming systems that can utilize a SATA drive if you don't want PCIe uh, again, this is an M.2 drive, so it is not like the original PCIe SSDs, like the OCZ Revo drives that came out some time ago. It's quite a bit different, and it's just mounted to a PCIe card, so you can plug that into your PCIe slot. The cool thing here, they had a system set up where, from Leon Lee, the case, uh, where the, the card was actually displayed front forward. So that's sort of a neat way to do it. And finally, this is using a Marvel controller, the new... Uh, HyperX Savage SSD, which is SATA, will be using the Fizon controller. A lot of companies are moving to Fizon as of this CES. Uh, we've seen a couple other ones moving that direction, and we're still waiting on the Sandforce Gen 3 products to start rolling out. So that's your update on the SSD market right now, at least as it pertains to HyperX, and we will see you all next time.